Our goal is to give you some of the feel for the very wide range of phenomena of things that people do. Have a little bit of fun and get you excited about this. One, two, three. I'm gonna close my eyes and I'm gonna calculate where the bowling ball comes back to. Put him out. He slowed down. It's easy to slow things down. Pull him in. And he speeds back up again. Okay, now just rotate it over. All the way over, all the way over. There we go. So that's the second can that it went through. They just float. And if I hit it right, I can get it to spin. But the thing is getting smaller and smaller and smaller. What you're hearing, you're applying heat to the water until finally it boils at its high temperature and starts to rise, which is kind of cool, right? Michaela is extremely brave. Watch her hair. You can see it frost up. Three, two, one. Yeah, there's up. This is light not moving in a straight line. The light isn't nearly as interesting as the information that it can move. You can use that color of infrared light or that frequency of infrared light to tell temperature. Every object produces infrared light at a color or wavelength that corresponds to its temperature. Thank you.